The world has created 7 billion tons of plastics and uh, less than 10% has been recycled. This has prompted some women engineers at the University of Zambia to team up and fight plastic pollution. Kasabula Mchimba caught up with some fifth-year engineering students who have innovated production of petroleum fuel using plastics. Here's a report. They showcase innovations and inventions made by themselves for the purpose of national development. These are women in technology and science. Students from the University of Zambia have developed a mechanism of converting plastic into fuel and they hope to meet national standards. This is at the International Women in Engineering exhibition held in Lusaka. Basically what we're trying to do is um, get fuel, uh, petroleum fuel, from plastics. In our chamber there we're using uh, HDPE, which is high density polyethylene. Uh, to the common person it's like a, 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 bo a, a bottle or a container of cooking oil. Yes. Other innovations have been showcased by students from different universities as well. It's a wearable device. So this device basically monitors heart rate and pulse rate. And then once it detects uh, the pulse rate and the heart rate, a notification is sent to your mobile phone. And for those with small phones, and, um, initially uh, the application will call the, the small phone. Women in engineering chairperson, Eni Muchelemba says the profession is still male-dominated and has called for more participation from women. She has, however, said the Engineering Institute is ready to support innovations which foster development. And so as an institution, we will try to engage the relevant stakeholders to see who can support this and take them to the next stage. As women in engineering, that our numbers are quite are still low. So as uh, a section of EIZ, our role is to inspire girls to come into this profession. This year's theme for the International Women in Engineering Day is innovations and inventions changing the industry for the better. Kasabula Muchimba, ZNBC News in Lusaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.